Hi there, and welcome to Oakland University William Beaumont School of Medicine. I'm Dr. Victoria Roach, an assistant professor in the Department of Foundational Medical Studies and one of the anatomy faculty at OUWB. Today, I'm here to give you a brief overview of our Anatomical Foundations of Clinical Practice course, so you can get a good idea of what to expect during your first semester of medical school. At OUWB, we recognize that a strong understanding of the foundational sciences like anatomy, biochemistry, and physiology help prepare you to enter the organ system part of the curriculum. These courses are the bedrock upon which your clinical knowledge will be built. We start with a solid introduction to both the anatomical and biomedical foundations of clinical practices through our two first semester courses, AFCP and BFCP respectively. These two courses, along with five longitudinal courses, will round out your first semester at OUWB. While AFCP and BFCP will fill your first semester, the longitudinal courses will span your entire pre-clerkship period. That is, the first two years of study at OUWB. While AFCP and BFCP help focus your studies on the foundational sciences for clinical practice, our longitudinal courses will teach you additional doctoring skills, like ethical decision-making, approaches to conduct physical exams, conducting and interpreting research, plus a whole lot more. One example is our PRISM course. PRISM focuses on your personal growth, wellness, and career development. But for right now, I'm going to focus on what you need to know about being a student of anatomy at OUWB. Because you probably haven't taken a course like this before, and you may be curious and even a little anxious about learning anatomy, I'm going to show you how it fits into your first year in medical school. If you've already had an anatomy course as an undergraduate, you've likely studied the body by systems. We teach anatomy regionally here at OUWB because we feel it's important for you as future physicians to understand how all of the structures in the human body are connected and work together. So we break down our AFCP course into four sections. Each focuses on different regions of the human body. Your AFCP1 course starts with the gross or macroanatomy of the back and upper limb and introduces concepts in microanatomy or histology and human development called embryology. This section spans about three weeks and ends with your first examination. AFCP is divided into lecture and laboratory parts. The lecture component allows faculty to introduce you to the complex clinical anatomy of the region so that you can have the confidence to dive deeper into the material outside of the lecture hall and in the lab. Our gross anatomy lab is a brand new facility. It's a well-outfitted, clean, and brightly lit learning space where we practice full body dissection. When you arrive in lab, you'll be assigned a lab group consisting of five to six of your peers and a lab dissection table assignment. At your dissection table, you and your lab group will find your donor. You may be more familiar with the term cadaver, but at OUWB, we prefer to use donor to recognize the special gift that these individuals have made to medical education. An online dissection guide, paper atlases of the human body, the anatomy faculty, and your peers will help guide your dissection. These resources will show you where to start and where to stop when making incisions. They will also highlight important anatomical relationships and landmarks on the body to recognize. Throughout the dissection experience, your team will identify the specific anatomical structures and study their clinical relevance. This amazing learning experience is made possible through the generosity of those who have donated their bodies to science. Consider these donors as your best resource for learning anatomy. The Anatomy Lab will be one of the most memorable and hopefully favorite experiences for a medical student. We have six to seven dedicated doctoral level faculty and state-of-the-art resources to help you and your classmates get the most from your experience. In addition to the Gross Lab, AFCP also focuses on the microscopic anatomy of the body through interactive virtual microscopy laboratories. You'll work in the same dissection teams, but instead of studying your donor, you'll explore a collection of virtual slides accessible through your computer. While anatomy forms a basis for surgery, histology lays the groundwork for a cadre of other specialties, such as pathology and immunology. Examinations in AFCP are two-part exams, consisting of a written and a practical component. The written exams will be multiple choice and rely heavily on clinical application. Practical examinations are short answer style and examine your understanding of the structures on the donors themselves. Both parts of the exam will occur on the same day and assess the same content. Each of the four sections mentioned earlier will conclude with an exam day. In addition to your written and practical examination grades, your final grade in the course will be composed of weekly online quizzes and assessments from the faculty and your classmates. These assessments will refer to professionalism, donor care, and quality of dissection. Because the donors are your first patients, we think that it's imperative that they're treated with respect and dignity throughout your learning process. The benevolence of the donor is taken very seriously here at OUWB. 
and we hope that you'll participate in the annual anatomy memorial ceremony. As M1s, you plan the ceremony which is held in the spring. This allows you to express gratitude to those who have donated their bodies to the study of medicine. AFCP won't be the last time you study anatomy at OUWB. Clinically oriented gross anatomy, histology, and embryology lectures are integrated throughout the organ system courses. You'll have focused gross anatomy laboratories using prosections, which are specimens that have been specifically dissected for you to study from. You'll continue to participate in virtual microscopy laboratories throughout the systems courses. In addition, a fourth year anatomy elective is also available. This elective, popular with students pursuing surgical residencies, allows students the opportunity to revisit anatomy that's pertinent to their specialty through an intensive month-long course. Before the course starts in the fall, we'll have a formal AFCP orientation to answer all of your questions about the course and the laboratory. We look forward to seeing you soon in AFCP. Welcome to OUWB.